But I think the, the concern was more with his family. His family was upset with what was being said on the internet and stuff. And, his, and I think they just wanted him to take a break. And he thought it was a good idea, so he, he took a break. Uh, do you think that the negative comments played a big part uh, in this? I don't know. I mean, you'd have to ask him. Um, uh, I can't. I can't read his mind specifically. Um, but uh, I just think he, he needs to take kind of a, a mental break from the game, and and you know, if it, if it helps him out and makes him you know want to come back and be you know, it makes. He says he wants to be a better player, a better person, you know, from it. If this is the three months, then, then fine. I'm, I'm okay with it. You know, it's going to be a, a huge sacrifice for his teammates not to have him here. You know, and, and uh, but, you know, we'll figure out a way. And, um, but when he comes back, you know, we'll be happy to have him back, obviously. Coach, from the conversations you had, you feel like this something uh, I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but my feeling is, is that he'll be back. And, you know, uh, I mean, obviously we'd like to have him back as soon as we can have him, you know, like this, they're all Filipino. But I think that maybe there's a good chance he'll come back to the second conference. You know, we'll see. But, again, you don't have to talk to him. You're, you're talking to me and I'm just guessing. Uh, but it's just my sense that he'll be back. And uh, uh, when we originally talked, there was, there was no talk about retirement. And I think that what he wrote, which uh, came out on Twitter, gave everybody the impression that he was looking for retirement. But I never got that sense. He just uh, he needed to take a break and get himself uh, mentally right to come back and play. He wasn't in a good spot. So, um, you know, that, that's, that's a tough thing to to do, you know, it takes, it takes some strength of character to be able to walk away from the game when you're not right and then uh, work your way because, you know, we're always in that panic if we leave or, you know, we're not going to have our job or whatever, but, you know, I think it's, it was a courageous decision for him. We'll see. What's that there in the Wilderness Cup? Are you being very vocal about the Empowerment of the Oh, it certainly it affects us. Uh, you know, he, he's gonna, we, have a, we have a huge hole in, in our lineup without him. You know, you take a talent like him away from you, it, it's, 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 it's a big, a lot of talent to make up. Um, but, you know, it's going to give you opportunities for everybody else. Uh, again, I, I was talking earlier about Chaffin and about what Chaffin can do now. Uh, not having to split time with Greg, he's going to be able to spread his wings and really say, this is my team. Uh, and, you know, it's usually, between the two of them, one's the Batman, one's the Robin. And, you know, it's kind of like game to game, you don't know who's the Batman and who's the Robin. But now, you know, Jap Jap is going to be the Batman. And, you know, Robin's taking a break at this point, so... Um, you know, so Jap is going to be able to spread his wings and... and and really show us, I think, what, what he can do. He's in a really good place mentally and physically at this point of his career. And uh, I think he's really going to take off this company. And we're, we're going to live with him you know, as, our, as our star. Uh, you know, he's going to have Stanley there, he's going to have LA there and, and others. But you know, I think Jeff will be the key guy for it. No, I've always been a big man's coach. You know, I've always done better with big men and uh, creating mismatches. And I think the, with size, you can dominate defensively a little bit more. You can protect the rim better. Um, so I've always been a guy that, that, that's like bigger lineups. So Greg's option is going to hurt. But, you know, again, uh, just as if when he had his ACL injury, we're going to have to try to adjust to life without him. And, and you know, guys are going to have to step up. Uh, in our practice game today, Prince played very well. Uh, hit, I think, three three-point shots and uh, uh, scored double figures, 15, 17 points. And, and I think that, you know, he's going to have an opportunity to play more. Uh, and if we can get 
Joe back uh, healthy uh, before the end of the conference, I think he'll impact it as well. Focus.